That breaking news tonight, fire crews are on the scene of a fire at a strip club in northeast Portland. It is the second fire at that business this year. Our Jennifer Dowling is live on scene there now. Jen, what are you seeing? Well, they're just starting to reopen Northeast Columbia here near Club Playpen. The fire is out at this time, but we still have fire crews here. Kind of keep an eye on hot spots, investigators on the scene as well. We've got the big ladder truck behind me, and the door is open here at Club Playpen. They got the lights on as they're continuing to check that building. Now, let's take a look at the video from earlier. Fire crews say that the fire actually started in the roof toward the back of the soffit. They tell me that they were on their way to a, fire, a different fire call about a cold fire that was already out when they spotted the flames in the back of the club. Now let's take a listen to a witness who was here uh, when he first smelled smoke and started seeing the fire crews arriving. 10 o'clock, my son came down to the store and said he was smelling fire. My coworker came on her break at, uh, it was about 9.45, I guess, ish, and she said she was smelling like fireworks or fire. Now, fire crews say the club, fortunately, was empty at the time that the fire broke out. They say the building was under construction following a fire, as we mentioned, a few weeks ago. So nobody in the club at the time, and fortunately, no injuries. They say they got the fire out within about 10 minutes of spotting it, so very quick. But it took a while. The streets were closed down here near Northeast Columbia as they were continuing to monitor it and also to investigate. But again, the streets are opening back up, and they will continue to investigate this throughout the evening. Back to you. Yeah, I'm sure investigators will be interested um, in this one because as you mentioned there, Jen, this is the second fire at Club Playpen this year. Firefighters put out an attic fire there in early January. That one broke out around 11 in the morning. Firefighters say that it probably started in a heating system on top of the club. The bartender who was inside when the fire started said everyone got out safely when they began seeing and smelling the smoke.